Hello. So today in this video, I'll show you how to write a chemical equation in the Google form. So I'll explain you step by step. You just go through this video from beginning to end. Now, let me open the Google form for you. Then I'll show you how you can write a chemical equation with a unicode it. Okay, I'll show you all these things. Let us first open a Google form. So you can type Google form in the search engine in the Google. Your Google form will be created. It will, it will open up. After this Google form open up, you create Now this is your Google form. You can give any title, chemistry questions. Now, how can you write subscript, superscript, and write it uh, equilibrium sign, all this sign, how can you plus minus sign, how can you give all these symbols in Google? So, there are many videos I have shown, means I have seen uh, like uh, e installing Equatio and other things are there, but those things are a little bit complicated as I find. This uh, unicodit.net, I find it very simple. If you know uh, the basic commands in LaTeX, or you can just Google it out the basic command of LaTeX and you can write. I'll show you one simple equation, how you can write. You can comment in the chat box that if you are having any problem in writing any equations, then you can write in the comment box. I can create one more video clarifying your doubts. Now let me open up the software and how can I write it? Let's say I want to write a displacement re reaction. So how will I write the displacement reaction? So let me write, suppose the displacement reaction, you know, the displacement reaction. I cannot write here directly sub subscript and superscript. So what shall I do? Suppose I want to write this equation. You can see, suppose this is a equation I want to write. Calcium plus two H2O gives CaOH all to calcium hydroxide plus hydrogen. So how I'll write this equation. So this is your equation. That is, Calcium, calcium plus 2H2, it's a balanced equation, arrow, it gives to CaOH whole 2 plus H2, calcium hydroxide. So I want to suppose write this equation in the Google form. I cannot write this directly, so what I'll do, I'll use the this website you note it down you can search in google unicode it code it.net again i'm showing you how you can do it just search in google uni c o t e i t unicode it okay unicode it So open up this website now in the left box, you can see two boxes are there. In left box, you have to write the write the expression. This is here also you can see it's written that it's a latex 
expression. So you know, LaTeX is a software which we use generally to write the scientific papers or different uh, mathematics books like that, we use it. But here, the LaTeX is inbuilt. So you can use your LaTeX commands. Okay, you can use any LaTeX command. You can search in Google the LaTeX commands and you can write the equations. Few examples are given here. X in, that means X belongs to minus infinity to in plus infinity. Here you can see the examples. Okay, so these are the symbols. So generally the LaTeX symbol takes the right slash like this one. Before a command, you have to write a right slash. So suppose you want to write, you want to give right arrow. So what you will type, the right arrow. You have to type it, but you can see it comes right arrow. You can see this one, right arrow. So now you can copy from right side and you can paste it in your Google form. Okay, I'll show one, two examples, then you, you will be clear. Now I'll write this equation first, that is calcium Ca plus will generally you will type plus then 2H2O, 2 also you can write simply 2, H you can write simply H, but how will you write the subscript 2? The command for short to write the subscript 2 H, you will write underscore this symbol, underscore, underscore symbol, and you will have to write most of the commands in LaTeX within a curly bracket. So within a curly bracket, you will write two. Now you see in the right side, this two comes in a subscript form. Whatever, the left side, you are just writing the your comments and right side, the things are coming up in a nice form. And you can copy directly and you can paste in the Google form. It will, it will means accept it, okay? So CA plus two H2O, it's very simple to write subscript and superscript. If you want to go more commands, you want to write more commands, then you can, just, if you want to learn, then you can comment in the chat box so that I can make another video or you can do one thing, you can search in the Google, it's what you will search, LaTeX commands. You can learn by yourself and all these LaTeX commands will be, will, will be, uh, means, uh, will work here and you can accept, I think fraction will not work as I know. So, but all most of the equations you can write. So calcium plus two H2O, how shall I give the right arrow? In command I'll write right slash right arrow, R-I-G-H-T, E-R-R-O-W, I'll write right arrow. You can see just when I complete right arrow, here a right arrow appears. Okay, now right arrow, CaOH hold two, calcium, Ca bracket, OH hold two. You can see, again, same procedure you will follow. Underscore two, plus H2, H, underscore curly bracket two. Okay, so you can see here the expression is, your desired equation is done. Now you can just copy it, go to the Google form. Go to the Google form and simply the displacement re chemical reaction chemical reaction you can write you can paste it here you can see now your expression is just like as you have written in the audit dot net just your equation is done. Now you can put the multiple choice question. You can put the options also. You can write it easily, many chemical equations. And also in mathematics or physics, if you are writing something and if you want to write subscript and superscript, then this will also help you. So how will you write superscript? 
this is subscript is done now just equation part i have explained one two three more things i'll explain you then we'll stop here so how will you write superscript suppose you want to write c a o o h all square then you how will you write you will give this symbol and again a same curly bracket and two you will write you can see you can write superscript c a o h superscript two right arrow i have told you how will you write plus minus symbol simply the right class pm will give you a plus minus symbol so these are the commands pm is the command or these are the latex command you can search in google and you can check all these commands now let me write how can i write equilibrium sign so you can write how will you write equilibrium sign you can see you can write the equilibrium sign by the right left arrow the command is that right left arrow right left okay right left arrow is this one right left harpoons you can write so that you can get this this type symbols also so here in the prompt you can check many things suppose you want to write x belongs to minus 2 to plus 2 mathematics you want to write so x slash in slash in is belongs to suppose 1 2 3 can write this type of means all these things you can do here uh, using this you need most of the means most of the things you can do except fractions you can do all these things if anyone knows how to write with this unicode dot it unicode it dot net how to write fraction i'll be happy to learn show sure, anyone you can comment in the comment box how to write fractions because as i find the fraction command is not uh, is not there in this unicode dot it unicode it not dot net so you can do it other means most of the things can be done if you want to write fractions you have to go to other solutions like equatia and other things okay so i hope this video is helpful for you and uh, we'll come with another video in the next tutorial thank you